Hi everyone, Michelle here at Serendipity House in New Hampshire. I'm doing a decoupage project. Maybe it's something that you want to try on your own furniture piece. I am using a decoupage queen rice paper. I love this print. It is Edgar Degas for dancers and it's got beautiful colors and the impressionist style is uh, very forgiving and I'm going to show you how to extend the paper and fool the eye by bringing some of the paint onto the paper. You are going to just have a beautiful piece when you're finished. You can find all the DIY paint and all the decoupage queen papers, everything I used here today on my website serendipity.house. one prep your piece i like to use white primer under my papers because they are somewhat translucent so a white primer will help you get a nice clear crisp background so that you don't see any dark coming through the fun part starts. I gotta say, I'm not a huge fan of all the prep work and there's a little stress to putting the decoupage paper on because when you're sealing it for the first time, you're gonna see some lifting and some bubbles, but here's what I've learned. You need to walk away from that because you can overwork your paper, you could rip it by accident, and somehow, miraculously, the next day, everything lays flat again. I'm using DIY paint for this project and I match these colors as best I can with some of the colors on here. I'm going to end up pouncing and mixing and shading and adding a lot of depth to this so they do not need to match perfectly. Let's go ahead and start blending. Walk away, have yourself a cup of coffee, uh, come back in a while and step back and see the whole image because my guess is you're doing better than you think.
so time lapse of about two hours i've been finger painting and brushing and husband just came out and said i know it's supposed to be ladies dancing but it looks like dante's inferno you know it's a work in progress and um, unsolicited advice is really not welcome here take the dark blue on the outside of this dresser and I am going to bring that color into my decoupage paper because no matter how well you're matching your colors they're not going to match perfectly but if you take your paint and you incorporate it onto the paper that blue or that yellow or that orange you're going to see the same exact color on the inside as well as on the outside of the paper that helps fool the eye <music> of the drawers for a little added extra interest. We are going to even match the dresser by pouncing blue and black paint on until we get a similar kind of muddled look. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my channel, follow me on all my socials, Serendipity House LLC, and you can find all of these products on my website, serendipity.house. Happy decoupaging.